One driver lost control of his vehicle and it was already way too late for him. To make the situation even worse, the traffic was really dense and he had no other choice but to hit a road barrier and crash. There are all sorts of reckless and careless drivers out there on the road and in this video we'll see a semi-truck driver who changed lanes without bothering to look and of course he caused his fellow semi-truck driver to get off the road completely. Skill of my wireless operator, I set course for the Westerland sector. Only for a brief second did I dare to look outside. Wisps of cloud passed by my wings, and as far as I could see, there was nothing but cloud no, 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 no. and more cloud. No, 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 no. My variometer showed a steady climb of nine feet per second. God damn it! The airspeed indicator oscillated peacefully between two. This video is definitely not for the weak-hearted. For those of you who have trouble watching crashes, I would suggest avoid this one. Some drivers just have to learn their lessons the hard way, and in this situation, the driver sure did. This is why we need to be really cautious while driving on icy and snowy roads. One small moment of impatience, or should I say, one driver's mistake, can cause someone else heavily. Making a safe lane change, simply indicating, is not enough. You definitely need to check your side view mirrors before proceeding to change lanes, because you have to know if another vehicle is right there. This is what happens when people try to act smarter than the traffic rules and traffic laws, like this driver who ran a red light and he thought he could get away with it. Let's just hope that none of the participants are injured.
my god. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Thinks that I'm with them. I'm cowering on the lounge chair, so we. For what it's worth, I'm a young East Asian female, and the fact that he was watching. It came to a spine chilling crash at the intersection here, and all because one driver was too impatient and he ran a red light. Hopefully, the participants are doing okay despite the damage on the vehicles. Cameron was just driving around and minding his own business, but he didn't think that another crazy driver would simply hit him and try to flee the scene. But that's exactly what happened. <laughs> this family was on their way to church, and they definitely didn't expect an outcome like this to happen to them. Check out what happened here and make sure to write me your thoughts on it. Please guys, avoid drinking and driving. If you're drinking, at least make sure someone else is driving the car. I mean, someone else who's sober. Don't do yourself a favor and be the cause of an accident like this guy here. Taking over a double solid yellow line is only something a psycho driver can do, and that's exactly whom we're dealing with right now.
crazy crash that happened right in front of the camera. Luckily, the one involved in it was not seriously injured. We have yet another rude driver who thinks that changing lanes without indicator or checking his side view mirrors is totally normal. This is what happens when people try to act smarter than the traffic rules and traffic laws. Like this driver who ran a red light and he thought he could get away with it. Let's just hope that none of the participants are injured. They are getting at least a serious trouble on the road, guys. Always try your best to keep a safe distance between you and another vehicle in front for your own safety. Hier voor uw veiligheid. Normale opname wordt gestart. This is why we say all the time that you need to adjust your speed limit according to the road conditions. And when the road is slippery from all the ice, like in this situation, you definitely need to ease up on the gas. In this situation, the van driver was a bit too hasty for his own good and he managed to slam his brakes but regardless of that, he made contact with a pedestrian who was trying to cross the road. In this video, you will see some of the most erratic and crazy driving out there ever recorded on the driver's dash cam. Check out the driver in a white golf right next to the camera. This guy was acting like a maniac on the road. 
but the sad thing is that they all got stuck at the next traffic lights, all of the vehicles. Very close call in which one driver was way too careless while making a U turn. He minding his own business while driving around, but all of a sudden he caught a crazy Ford Mustang driver losing control of his vehicle and hitting the sidewall. Damn, they got crashed. Oh shit. Hope he's okay. You dumb. What are you doing? The driver ran a stop sign and he swerved all over the road. And this video is yet another proof of why you should keep a safe distance between you and other vehicles.
In this situation, we can say that the Mercedes driver got what he asked for. He dangerously cut the camera off and he proceeded to speed down the road. But a bit further down the road, he caused an accident. Oh, oh, Anne Frank. What, Muso and Frank? Posture. Yeah, uh, okay. No, it's Muso and Frank, like the one from, you know, the diary. The <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was thinking about when I was saying. I don't know why I always thought it was that, and then I thought it was Muso Frank's. But anyway, now we need to see the sign. As keep going. As portrayed in the yes. time in Hollywood, mm -hmm. with the opening scenes. Yes. Um, footnotes all of this. Yes, we park two blocks east. In this video, we have a pickup truck driver who more or less made a really poor U-turn. He took his sweet time and he was definitely a beginner or who knows, maybe even drunk or distracted. Here's Joe Taylor. Here is the light. Snow for us today. Two or three centimeters possible are guaranteed high. Minus one tonight. Partly cloudy. Few flurries. Minus six. Winter for some wind. Over at Pearson. Life snow continues there. Temper there we go. Mm -hmm. City News Time 12:43. Now the Dynamic Funds Market Minute. Live in the business. Go first for your reasonable to me. Then this one we're gonna force. 
work at the same time, but let's wait on that. No, I should explain it. Oh. Oh, oh, you want to explain no, the knowledge? No, you should let, because here's the thing, we're scientists. Well, yeah, we're scientists. No, well, well, I was, my, well, if I can explain a three-minute story about my friend who is a research chemist real quick. Okay. But well, what I was going to say... It would appear that this crazy driver is totally in a hurry to get somewhere. He was cutting across the road like a madman, from lane to lane switching without bothering to check his mirrors or indicate. Of course, other drivers were endangered as well. And please note to yourself, never behave like this guy. Talk about your bad luck in this situation right here, for the Kia driver. Out of all the vehicles he could have rear-ended, he chose to rear-end a police officer.
What? They're gonna find Allah. From under. Truck driver was speeding through dense traffic, and let's just say that he got a piece of instant karma served to him. In which the camera got hit head on by a crazy pickup truck driver. Check this one out. came across a crash aftermath and it looked like a heavy accident happened. Of course, he did the right thing by pulling over to the side and he immediately went over and checked on the participants. Hopefully, none of them were seriously injured. As the van driver tried to park his vehicle, he somehow managed to graze another parked car that was there. Of course, he didn't bother looking for the owner and apologizing, let alone asking to fix the damage. But he didn't know that it was all caught on a camera. In this video you can see what happens when drivers don't obey the traffic signs. This driver didn't want to yield to a semi-truck driver and it came to a horrific crash. Amazon delivery guy was in a such a hurry that he even forgot to close his door. Luckily the packages didn't fall out, well at least not yet. Video, you'll see how a driver with a fragile ego reacts when being overtaken by a semi truck. Instead of letting it all go and minding his own business, this guy started to race up and down the road.
close attention at the driver on the left hand side of the camera. This guy was struggling to maintain his lane position and that could have caused everyone much damage. This just happened, and of course, an NPC pedestrian who crossed the road without bothering to look both ways first caused the accident. Biker was trying to slowly brake at first, but when he noticed that he is approaching way too fast, he panicked braked, and because of that he crashed. <laughs> Patient driver ran a red light and he pulled out at the intersection right in front of another vehicle and it almost came to a collision between the two. It's always quite scary when a driver loses control over his vehicle due to icy roads, especially if it's a huge truck.
Oh, wow. You know what I forgot to do? What? Turn the thermostat. What thermostat? In the bedroom and also in the hallway. I did. You did both? Because I turned it down when I was doing my thing. <laughs> Oh my god, I forgot! <laughs> the, the bed, what, do you, do you have? Yep, there it is. There he is. Ah, uh, there he is, he got somebody. Wait, isn't that our little friend that I blew do. by us? <laughs> oh! Then Java should definitely go back to driving school in order to understand the right of way. Next to this video, you can develop a clear cut picture as to with whom we share the roads. These drivers are acting out of pocket by running red lights, and that's something we will never advise you to do. After all, traffic lights are there for a reason, and we definitely need to obey them. Then at that point I thought, well, I'm going to do 10 push-ups for Arnold and have him comment on. So we'll, you'll have to stay tuned All right. to, to see That's what happens. The end. you got to hang in there. Wait.
Someone's there, stupid. You don't get any uh, UX diving. What are you doing? UX diving. Oh my god! It was at this moment that he knew he f***ed up. According to the Arkansas State Police, Troopers saw 19-year-old Tyrese Lancaster speeding on I-530 near exit 24. When the trooper tried to stop him, Lancaster sped off, reaching over 140 Malankariunk. He exited at exit 30, weaved through traffic, and was pursued by multiple troopers. At exit 35, Lancaster lost control and crashed into a guardrail. Troopers found a gym bag with unopened beers in his car. Lancaster was treated for minor injuries and arrested. He faces charges including reckless driving and possession of alcohol by a minor. Yeah. 
In a wild police pursuit on November 22, 2021, in the USA, the chase concluded with a well-executed PIT maneuver on a Jeep. The maneuver brought the high-speed chase to a successful and safe end, demonstrating the precision and skill of the officers involved. Check it out to see the impressive moment unfold.
car. Your left hand. Open the door with your left hand. Keep both hands up. Keep both hands up. Both hands up. Keep your hands up. Keep your hands up. Put your hands on the roof of the car. Outside. I've got less lethal. Keep your hands up on the roof. Step out of the vehicle. Step out of the vehicle now. Step away towards me. Get on the Put your hands on you. You see that guy? Oh, yeah. Got it? Ow. Clear. Car's clear. Mustang driver attempted to flee from the police but quickly faced swift justice. Check it out.
not move, do you understand? Ten fifteen at old man. They're oblivious. Oh! Oh! And well, she wonders why her car looks like that. <laughs> Top right here too, right? Beautiful. God. Were you just sitting there to? I was just coming to get a red bull. <laughs> working, working the movie thing since six o'clock this morning. I'm pretty sure you're up now. <laughs> accident and the airbag goes off and you squash the dog to death and two it could cause an accident because you could be distracted and he drives already like he's distracted That wasn't good. 
I can stop here without a problem, mate. Use the crossing next time, okay? That's the crossing. Impatient driver ran a red light and he pulled out at the intersection, right in front of another vehicle, and it almost came to a collision between the two. Cameron was just driving around and minding his own business, but he didn't think that another crazy driver would simply hit him and try to flee the scene. But that's exactly what happened. Impatient driver couldn't wait a second or two for the camera to leave his parking space. He was so persistent, so the camera barely had any time to get out. Check this one out. dramatic police pursuit on May 22, 2022 in the USA. A car veered off course and flipped onto a golf course. The troopers, acting swiftly, had to kick in the windshield to rescue the trapped driver from the overturned vehicle. This intense scene unfolded as law enforcement worked quickly to ensure the driver's safety amidst the chaos. 117 coming across uh, College Boulevard.
Dude, he run it up to 120 coming through that intersection. 823. I got a van when you're ready. You smoke. Last time I smoked before I got here. Before you got here, where's where's here at? Don't touch me if you're holding oh. his hands, please. It was it was two hours ago. Two hours ago. Two hours ago. Chase by the Arkansas State Police, the suspect's car malfunctions, leading the trooper to perform a pit maneuver. The suspect then has to climb out of the vehicle. Let's see how it all went down.
hands! Show me your hands! Leave your hands right there where I can see them. You hear me? You understand what I'm telling you? Solomon Grove Road, Road 65. Get out of the car. Get out. Turn it off. Turn it off. Get out of the car. Crawl out. Crawl out. Leave your hands where I can see them and crawl out. Get out! Get out! Get on the ground. Get on the ground. Turn over. Turn over. Put your hands behind your back. Ten fifteen thirty nine. Driver tosses meth while fleeing Arkansas State Police Trooper claiming it's a cigarette. This wild chase ends with the arrest of the reckless driver. Check it out. charged for it. You hear me? That's tampering on top of the possession. Get up. Get up. I'm a look, dude. Either you gonna get up. I'm trying. Get up right now. Turn around. You got anything else on you other than the bags you threw out? I had a beer, bro. You had a beer? That's what about the bags of white powder? You know what? Don't say another word. Powder. You under arrest. No, 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 no. Go now. What? Pushing against me. I'm not Push pushing against me one more time. I'm not pushing against you. I'm gonna man. plant your ass on this paper. I'm not pushing against you and I stop. You stop? Yeah. Yeah, you stopped at 90 miles an hour. That's all right. I, I'm gonna tell you why, man. I don't care why. Get in the car. Now! Man, get in the car! Like that, man. Get in the car or I'm gonna put you all the way across it. Get in there. No! You ain't getting nothing. Get in my car out on the highway like that, bro. Your car ain't getting left. It's getting towed. Get in the car. <clears throat> 12 over 10 <clears throat> If you would, go ahead and start the next roll back. <clears throat> Is there another there unit anywhere near me? GA is on a 2 <clears throat> 
Ten four G eight. <clears throat> he threw out two bags of white powder. If you're coming from Hope, it'll be before between the first two bridges, right there on the yellow line. State Police. This is what so, Mr. Todd has been arrested. He is going to be going to the Hempstead County Jail um, in Hope. Okay. Is there? I'll I will have him call you from the jail though. He'll. Ma'am. Uh, the car is going to be towed. It will be at Red River Wrecker Service in Fulton. Uh, no, no, ma'am. After after fleeing a traffic stop, uh, I'm not going to let the car go. I understand. I'm sorry. That's a choice Mr. Todd made. So I'm I'm sorry about that. I really do hate it. If he'd have pulled over, probably wouldn't have been nearly this bad. I'd have been happy to let the car go if he could just pull it over. But, all right, I will have him call you just as soon as he gets done getting booked in at the jail, okay? Yeah. Yes, ma'am. Man, I, I'm to be honest, I just, I didn't, I, man, I knew the tags we put on. Look, man, it, it doesn't matter, okay? You made your choice, you gotta live with it. Yeah, I, I just, I, but I, I had, what am I getting charged with? Uh, as of right now, fleeing. Fictitious tags, speeding, um, tampering with physical evidence, and whatever they find back there on that yellow line. I ain't doing anything. Okay, it's on camera, dude. It's on camera. So quit, I'm quit bull you. crapping me. It's on camera. All right, I'd be more than happy to show you video when we get to the jail. I pull it up. And you drop it out of your left hand, right there on the middle, on the yellow line. So don't sit back there. And, I didn't drop nothing. You did. All right, you're a grown man. It's time to play, play the grown man game. You made a choice. You're going to live with it. Now, whether you continue to lie about it or not, that's on you. I don't care. Oh, an open container of alcohol in your view. Yeah, but, 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 but nothing. All right, we're done. All right, you're done. You got caught. Deal with it. Uh, but that's that's what I'm telling you. That's why I did, man, I didn't want to, and I knew I had the open container. The open container, I don't care about. It's the crap you dumped out on the middle of the road. What? It's on camera. Seriously. If you're not going to own up to it, then just shut up. We ain't got nothing to talk about. All right? Huh? Back seat, your side. It's unlocked. Hey, camera's on. Camera's on. Do you? Marcus Todd. You remember me? Hey, could you fix his glasses? He wants his glasses on his face. Thank you. I thought you went to the big house. When'd you get out? You were with Ronnie last time. Elmer? Throw some more meth out the window? Man, I, I had a cigarette, bro. That's what I, and I that's, that's what he think of, though. I threw a cigarette, bro. Oh, we're going to go find it. Don't worry. We're going to find it together. We're going to find it. You had meth last time. We're going to find it again. I didn't have no meth on me last time. Didn't oh, fell out your pocket last time, Ronnie. Didn't have none. All right, Marcus. Watch your knees. G12, uh, Red River 97.
Aerodynamics is a, is a key part of this. They do have side mirrors. I guess they can't get rid of those yet. Not yet, yeah. They're working on that. But uh, what else do they do? I mean, by the way, there's a kind of a benefit to making it really uh, good. Looks like a battle. Yeah, it does. Yeah. yeah, it does. Um, so yeah, they did a lot of interesting things with the battery pack design itself, uh, with how they how they configure the cells in the battery pack and connect them all up. Um, they also, uh, their power electronics system, which is a, a key part of this, uh, that's, you know, the battery stores energy. Uh, I like, like all-wheel drive. Am I crazy to like all-wheel drive? No, I don't know. It's I just, I don't know why. I don't know. The, uh, the touring. Dramatic Arkansas State Police Chase A female driver with a baby in the backseat reversed into a trooper's car during a chaotic pursuit on the interstate. Semi-trucks helped slow and stop her vehicle, but she then attempted to flee in reverse, causing an accident before being apprehended. Oh, 
No, she's going the wrong way. She just ran me. I did try to pit her and she got back out of it. I got pretty heavy damage to the front end.
Come back here, Brad. Come back here. Get out of the car so we can get your baby! Get out of the car so we can get your baby! Get out of the car! Get out, of the car. Get out, of the car. Get out so we can get to your baby! Get out of the car with your hands straight up in the air so we can check on your baby! Yes, ma'am, open the door and get out and put your hands straight up in the air! No, ma'am, we don't want to hurt you! Please, get out of the car! Brad, come over here with me. I got you. Alright, want me to approach? Y'all got me? Hang on, let us come around to you. She's not gonna lose the Brad. Let's approach. Brad, where you at? Right here. Stand by. 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 Stand Pursuit ended with PIT maneuver. Check it out. Frontier Diner. Hey, you're on the north side of Sherbourne West? Yes, sir. I'm not working. We're about to cross over 430 if we don't get on 430. More right here in front of the outlet on the north service road. Four thirty north. Come on, stage coach. 
coming up on the stagecoach. Stagecoach speed 120. Taking stage coach. Going west on Highway 5 at 4.30. Otter Creek, stagecoach. Parkway. Had, had a chance to head up to the head in. Nine, we're going to be behind A4. It looks like a single occupant, black male driver, OT, do rag. Right. Stage coach, stage coach, speed 120. Show me your hands! Show me your hands! Right now! Finish this episode with police pursuit who happened 10 days ago in Memphis. This crazy police chase was against Cadillac who tried to flood the scene with 141 MBPH. This is how it all went down. F-38-4, City F-38. 
Martin Luther King loves. It's a black Cadillac poster car. In Tennessee drive out clean. Adam King 91. Queen Henry. Queen Adam King 91. Queen Henry. Yeah. You gonna pull back out or you gonna stop? Job. Yeah, when he drove by, we got a car view on out. 